Hi, sixth grade. It's Miss Eastwood here uh, with a le weekly library lesson for you. And I'm sorry that I can't be on the screen live with you today. Um, but I have a fun activity for you um, to complete independently. And you can tell me some feedback next week, whether you liked it, didn't like it, all that fun stuff. Um, but so I'm going to go into our grade six library, okay? Um, and you'll see a new material that I posted this morning called Culture Grams. Now, this one-click link should let you just get right onto the website, um, but I have included the username and password if for some reason it doesn't automatically log you in, okay? So username is Pine Tree, password is school, okay? So when you click the link, it should bring you to this page. We're going to go with the green kids edition. Click explore, and you'll see you're brought to a map, um, and it's pretty neat. This is an interactive map. So if I click on Europe, it will bring me to a close-up of all of the countries in Europe. And maybe I want to click on Germany, right? So um, there's all sorts of neat tabs on the side um, that organize the information in an easy-to-find manner. Um, let me first show you. So if I go back to our... Google Classroom, here's the worksheet that I'll also pass out so you can um, do it digitally or hard copy. Um, and it says holidays around the world, right? Because um, a lot of us celebrate Christmas, but it's interesting to explore what other countries celebrate. Um, so I have three very easy questions for you. Um, so holidays around the world, choose the country, okay? Um, and I just want you to tell me what the most popular holiday is in that country right arguably ours would be christmas and that's coming up and but that's not the same worldwide right so i want you to tell me what it's called and when does it happen okay um the second box is traditions so how do they celebrate it do they make a certain kind of food right do they all sing certain songs and parades right what are their traditions surrounding this holiday and then um, the last column is fun facts. So anything interesting that you learned about this country. So when you're on culture grams, um, on the left-hand side is there's actually a tab that says holidays, okay? So, and there's this play button here, so it'll read everything to you, okay? So you can either read this or if it's um, challenging, right? You can have it read to you. Um, and then so after you answer the holiday questions, play around on some of the other tabs if you want for um, those fun facts. Uh, I know a lot of kids really like the can you say it, so it'll try and teach you German, right? Um, and it's fun to listen to. So hello is guten tag, um, goodbye, auf Wiedersehen, right? Bitte, danke. Um, so it gets pretty interesting on some of the countries, like trying to um, – pronounce their language, uh, their words in their language. Um, so this playback button really becomes handy then. Um, but whatever you're interested in, right? Um, there's history, there's lifestyle. So life as a kid is another really popular tab. Um, economy. Um, oh, Germany has awesome castles. So fairy tale castles is a really fun one to look at. Um, but anyway, so on your worksheet, um, I want you to do at least two countries, okay? Um, you don't, you can do more if you would like to, um, but try and do at least two. And then if you're done early after doing two and you're like, all right, that's enough, I don't want to do any more, um, you can either read silently at your desk or you can go on one of our other digital resources, okay? Um, let me know if you have any questions. Um, I will be available by email in my classroom. Okay, so um, have a wonderful day. I can't wait to see you next week. And um, I will talk to you guys soon.